that's about as efficient as you played for three quarters and then the fourth quarter it kind of changed. Was it just a matter of them kind of getting into you and contesting shots better in the fourth or shots not going down? A little bit of both. I think uh, overall you still want to uh, maintain the you know, integrity of the offense that you have for the first three quarters of moving the basketball, uh, just trusting it, getting it to the open guy. I thought we were trying to be aggressive getting to the rim, uh, which you know, it's a good thing, good idea. Uh, and we only had 12 free throw uh, attempts tonight, so uh, we tried to continue to be aggressive. Jack, what uh, was your rationale for playing Ben Gordon for the majority of the fourth quarter, and, and could your offense have benefited from having Alfred uh, orchestrate the offense? Spacing. Uh, Coach, uh, just talk about uh, the decision uh, David Blatt made in keeping uh, Kevin Love out in that fourth quarter and how that affected your decision making uh, as far as him having LeBron at power forward. Well, it's unique. You know, uh, your power forward is bringing it up and he's orchestrating the offense and he's getting to the rim and he's got shooter space around him and a dynamic roller set the screen. Uh, pretty tough to guard. Go ahead. Go ahead, Sam. Right. You, you, the, after the Celtics game, you talked about wanting to find that better balance, you know, offensively and defensively between the first and the second units. How did you feel that was tonight? Well, I think overall, production-wise, uh, we got some contributions from a lot of guys. So uh, we were able to uh, kind of mix and match our bigs uh, because of Kyle's foul trouble. Uh, but I think it produced uh, pretty decent you know, offense efficiently. Um, and then you know, defensively, I thought, we did some good things also, so overall, I liked it. Uh, Vooch had, uh, I think, career high of assists, seven assists, but do you need him looking to maybe score there with, with Tristan on him uh, in the post or maybe a little more of a, a low post game the way he was playing early in the year? Well, I think overall, he just has to uh, take what he wants, and so sometimes he's going to have his jumper, sometimes he's going to be able to back guys down. Uh, just time and score, what do we need at the time? I thought early on in the game, he was setting the table by uh, getting guys open shots. You seem to match Tobias's minutes with LeBron's for most of the most of the night. What does that What does that say in the confidence that you have in Tobias as a defender and and the steps that he's taken to improve himself on the defense side of the floor? I think he's really grown. I think uh, what it really says is uh, he's a competitive individual, and uh, the more guys we have like that, the better. Jock, uh, the Cavs uh, outscored you twenty seven. 14 in the fourth. Do you see that tonight's fourth quarter struggles as kind of a continuation of your team's difficulties uh, getting too tight down the stretch of games? Or do you see this as a different, as a not continuing to pattern? No, I don't think we got tight at all down the stretch. I think a, a big part of this league, if you watch all five games yesterday, is uh, at the end of the game in the fourth quarter, uh, having the ability to put the basketball in someone's hand and that someone makes a play. Uh, how many possessions at the end of the game was the ball in LeBron's hand, and he made the play for himself and for his teammates. And we're still growing and understanding who we want the ball uh, in whose hands and how to finish once the ball is in that person's hands. Um, um, sort of on that, sort of on that point, <coughs> this being a young team with guys who are maybe taking on that role for the first time, is there? Maybe do they maybe do you feel like maybe they try to try to force things a little bit at the end at the end of games or force things a little bit where they might not be there to kind of have that goal and, and accomplish that task? I just think uh, they haven't been in this territory before. Uh, you take four different possessions at the end of a game. Nick shot a jump shot. Uh, Vic had the basketball go off for him. Evan tried to spin and get to the rim, and Tobias missed the jumper also. Uh, so these guys haven't been in this position. I love that they're taking the shots. We'll continue to put ourselves in this position and they'll find success. Everyone good? All right, thank you. Thanks, guys.